So last night was a little weird at the hostel in that uh, the Wi-Fi cut out basically after I got back from dinner. So normally I'm able to do at least some work um, overnight if I, get, if I get any emails or anything. But uh, yeah, so for a whole shift essentially I didn't have internet. So that was a little rough. Um, fortunately nothing really urgent came up for, I guess, brunch, I guess. Uh, I met up with... Uh, uh, another person who's staying in my room. We went to uh, just a Thai place, and I had some. I think it was grilled catfish. Um, it was very bony, and there was not much meat, but it was still good. And then there was uh, some fighting shrimp. But uh, so him and I talked about, or because he had uh, traveled a lot more, so he was giving me some tips as far as uh, things to do and see in Bangkok and uh, in Thailand and just around Asia in general. I started heading north to my hostel, and then I realized that I forgot my towel in the last place, so I still have to uh, figure out what I'm going to do with that as far as replacing it. Most places give you, like, particularly hotels, give you towels, um, but it comes in handy just walking around. It'll be, you know, 90 degrees with 80% humidity, like it was today, um, so having something to be able to wipe yourself off while you're walking comes in handy. At least, if anything, it gives me an excuse to go shopping, because... That's one problem with being a minimalist. Like, I like shopping, but I don't need anything. So it's hard to really talk myself into buying anything. So at least that gives me something to shop for. I stopped by is the same company that I went to a couple weeks ago. It's a Tom and Tom, or Tom and Tom's uh, coffee. I had a, uh, it was a cookies and cream Thai iced coffee frappuccino. Like, I don't know. They just threw a bunch of words together, but it was very good. Walked through a mall near there for a little bit. And then made my way up north, checked in. So, hotels, pretty basic. There's a lot of like stain on the wall and ceiling, so that's a little disconcerting. Side. The fridge is a little weird, like normally you just get like two bottles of water and I was like, whoa, they gave me six bottles of water. So these are all mineral water and these are all 15 baht, which isn't much, but it's like, <laughs> okay, <laughs> kind of wish they'd given me the space or something else. And, uh, bathroom. Got my shelf, which is good. I like it when they have the dispenser like this because sometimes I need a lot of soap for laundry and sometimes they'll only give you like a bar of soap or a tiny little bottle, so it's good to have that. Oh, and then, uh, it's not in my room technically, but there's like this random patio area, so I guess you can go out and smoke. Or jump to your, not death, but <laughs> wouldn't be fun. I'm noticing that you could pretty much check in half an hour early at most places, so I don't have to worry about killing too much time before I check in. Worked for a while, and then uh, for dinner I went out to uh, this place called uh, Grand Ramen. It was a weird mixed bag. So the ramen itself was really good. I had a uh, tonkatsu or um, shio ramen, so it's either like a fatty or a salty broth. Um, and then it had uh, some uh, uh, tempura fish or fried fish in there. It wasn't really a tempura texture, I don't think. That was good. It was <laughs> I always love good ramen. Um, but then the beer, she was asking if I wanted ice, and I was, after the other night I was like, no, 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 no ice. And then she had me fill the bottle, and the bottle was warm. So it's like, why are they even serving warm beer? So this weekend, I might try to do a um, trip up north that I've been... I think I've been deleting it every time I'm talking about it, but I've been talking about it for a while now, um, I'm going to try to go up to uh, Ay 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 Ayutthaya, or Ayutthaya, I'm not that good with Thai pronunciation, um, there's like a, some more uh, uh, historical landmarks around there, uh, so I might stay there for a night, they have like uh, weekend markets where you can get like fried bugs and all that, so I might do that, and then uh, from there go up to Chiang Mai. And then come back around Monday night, which would be Monday morning, for the States. 
Um, I'm a little worried about internet when I'm out in Ayutthaya, but uh, the guy I was having lunch with was saying that in Chiang Mai it's decent enough, so I should be okay out there. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. I just realized <laughs> the hostel I was leaving this morning had free ice cream, and I forgot to grab some. I got some free coffee, but I forgot. Can I have free ice cream? I think it's everything. So, uh, until tomorrow. I don't like that's my catchphrase. But I can't think of anything better. So, until tomorrow. <laughs>